In this problem, we're going to solve a triangle given two angles and the length of a side opposite one of the angles. We want to determine the three remaining parts of this triangle. We're given two of the angles. Angle, angle A is measure 41 degrees. Angle B is measure 22 degrees. And we're given the length of side A is 12 units. We'll go ahead and start by finding the third angle measure. So we know every triangle has 180 degrees we can find this missing angle measure by subtraction. So 180 minus 41 minus 22 is equal to 117. So angle C is a measure of 117 degrees. We can use the law of sines to find the length of side B. The sine of angle A divided by A is equal to the sine of angle B divided by B. The sine of 41 degrees over 12 is equal to the sine of 22 degrees over B. If we solve for B, multiply both sides by B, multiply both sides by 12, we get B times the sine of 41 degrees is equal to 12 times the sine of 22 degrees. Or B is equal to 12 times the sine of 22 degrees divided by the sine of 41 degrees. And put that into our calculator, we'll get that B is approximately 6.85 units. We'll go ahead and use the law of sines again to find the length of side C. So the sine of angle A over A is equal to the sine of angle C over C. Sine of 41 degrees over 12 is equal to the sine of 117 degrees over C. And we'll multiply both sides of the equation by C and multiply both sides by 12 to get C times the sine of 41 degrees is equal to 12 times the sine of 117 degrees. This gives us that C is equal to 12 times the sine of 117 degrees divided by the sine of 41 degrees, which is approximately 16.3. So the third side has length roughly 16.3 units.